have you been for the past three days? Pretending you've been going to work every morning? And how long, how long is it going to be before I have to come here and pick you up off the sidewalk? You, you got hurt? Pain in you? Well, I used to live with a man who had the pain and made the hurt work for him. Your daddy died with dignity. With no bomb in him. And he, he knew hurt you ain't never heard of. Mama, why did you leave the South? And I mean that 30 years ago when you were a young woman, why did you leave the South? I guess I, I left for the same reason everybody does, I guess. I, I thought if I were to come up here, I, I could do better for myself. Although I can't say I set the world on its end since I've been here. Yeah, but you didn't let anybody the right to stop you once you figured out you had to go, even though you knew you weren't going no place at all, Mama, now did you? Mama, did you? And why is it okay for you to stop me from getting on my train when my time come, Mama? Uh, oh, Mama, I don't think it's ever going to come again. I don't think it's going to come again, Mama. down on a house from your father's life insurance money that leaves $6,500 on Monday morning. I want you to put $3,000 in a savings account for your sister beneath us medical school and, and, and then I want you to put $3,000 in, in a checking account with, with, with your name on it. And any penny that goes in, comes out, it's for you to say, for you, for you to decide. And it's all the money I got in the world. It's not much, but I'm putting it in, in your hands, son. And I'm telling you, from now on, you be the man. You be the head of this family like you're supposed to be. Baba, Baba, you really trust me like that, Baba? I ain't never stopped trusting you, baby. Just like I ain't never stopped loving you, sir. <laughs> 